Hi, I'm Candace with LDA Creations. Thank you for watching another one of our design videos. This is meant to inspire you to um, submit some artwork to us for some dinnerware for yourselves. The, the winner of the contest will get a, um, some, a set of dessert plates with your art on it. And so it's good to have some inspiration to uh, give you some ideas of what to uh, put on your plates. And um, that'll be a nice thing for you to have. Um, we've done other videos that we've covered geometric designs. We have covered um, monograms. We've covered um, just little icons that mean something to you, a fleur de lis or a, um, a, uh, a fish or, or whatever it is that you like. So, um, and last time we covered um, things that are inspired by architecture, and those are nice. We also did the closet, the, the things that are in your closet, some clothing um, that you might have that you can get patterns from. That would be an inspiration for a plate. So, today we are doing things that are inspired by nature. And um, this was actually a very easy one to put together because a lot of the, the things that you already see are, you know, they have leaves on them or they have flowers. Those kinds of things are pretty common. So, um, but to make it all your own is just a very, uh, it's a very cool thing. And so I recommend that all of you um, try to find something like that. The first one I have is a little back to biology class. Let's see if you can remember this. Yeah. <laughs> laugh and look at that. Um, uh, it's parts of a cell. We all remember that. The, um, the, there's a part of that called a mitochondria, and it's the um, energy source for the cell. But anyway, but it's, it's actually a cool shape, and that's an artist rendering of it. But it's, it's a cool shape, and so, um, you know, this is to show you can get inspiration anywhere. And so if you wrap that little mitochondrion, see that shape, around that plate, <laughs> it really is cool. And so, um, I highly recommend that. I think that's just a fun thing. So see what kind of things you can see through a microscope, and um, if you Google that, some things are kind of disturbing, but um, there's some cool things in there. Um, I like the black. I really like this sand, um, sandy green color. Anyway, there's your mitochondria in the plate. Um, the next thing, a bit more expected, I reckon. Um, this is a dogwood, Virginia State flower. And these are um, drawings I did. I did all these drawings of, of dogwoods. Um, you don't want the same kind of bloom if you're repeating it, not necessarily all the time. Um, most of the things you've seen to me have seen from me, I've, I've you know, wrapped things around the, the band of a plate. This one's different, it makes it more fun. It's kind of a whimsical um, thing of, of dogwoods blowing in the wind, is what, what my intention was with that. And it's just lovely. There's a zebra, that's the thing from nature. To have a zebra pattern is is all kinds of fun. That's an enjoyable thing. Um, I'm gonna come back to that uh, here in a second. Um, fish, fish are always fun. Interesting thing is I was I drawn some fish and I put it around the plate, and um, I still had this zebra pattern up when I was doing it on my computer. And the cool thing was I deleted it, then I brought it back because that zebra pattern in a different color is really cool behind all those fish. I thought that was neat. And so, um, it, you know, in a different, the zebra stuff in a different color, um, it looks like water. So, and I've also done it the same thing with the fish are white. I like that one a lot too. So many fun things in nature. And the last thing, Anyone, anyone who knows me at all knows I have Scotties. So um, there's a Scotty dog, and there's some art that I did um, putting a Scotty in the middle of a plate. And this, you probably recognize this plaid border from the geometric, the geometric video that we did. So um, anyway, so there's these are good examples of things from nature. Um, you know, don't just stop with leaves and flowers. You know, mitochondria is a good idea of something to do. Um, animals and, and other things like that. So anyway, please like our channel and uh, subscribe to it. We'd be delighted about that. And send in your submissions for your contest. And we're looking forward to seeing those. And um, 
We hope this has been an inspirational thing for you, and um, we look forward to seeing your submissions. Thanks for watching.